The Cheese Boy 628 Show, starring Cheese Boy 628. Hey YouTube, what's going on? This is Cheeseboy628 here today giving you a monotype Wi-Fi battle versus my buddy Sample Sounds. The link in the description is an awesome fella. Now before I get into this team preview, you guys know my schedule has kind of been inconsistent lately. Let me tell you, the college life is definitely getting to me. I have a lot to study for. My first exam week is this week, so I apologize. I promise I'm getting out as many uploads as I can. But let's get into this team preview. As you can tell by typing, it is neutral. But, because of the pokes that I chose, I have a sled advantage. With my use of U-turn and a lot of fire moves against Arachi, I should have a decent advantage, although he does definitely have some bulky mons. Let's see how this battle goes. So I'm going to be starting off my talent flame as it is a pretty darn good lead. has access to U-turn, some really strong moves that are going to hit his team really hard. I do have the banded U-turn and since I'm at him at max speed, I do outspeed him by one point if he's timid, but I do get a crit and that certainly mattered and I apologize immensely because that certainly mattered by doing only at most 80% or so. And the thing is, I do have heat trans, so I probably would have just gotten into that, but the fact is he still would have had a lot of use to hit something relatively hard. As I do have an air balloon heatran, so I'm definitely more of the offensive variant as he goes for rocks. And then he goes for aura sphere, which coming from a defensive knee doesn't do a ton, especially to an offensive heatran, but it still does a decent chunk and gets rid of my balloon. He's gonna go for another aura sphere as it's possibly one more hit to take me out, but I'm not 100% sure. I'm gonna go for the lava plume. I do get the burn. Synchronize is not going to affect me, although I wish it would give me a flash fire boost, but that's not gonna happen in this old land here. So he's going to get burned though, which is really nice. I don't know if he has heal belt or soft boiled or roost, but I guess we'll find out soon enough. This aura sphere is not enough to take me out. So this lava plume is going to be very crucial damage if he does not have any recovery moves. And so you're going to see here, he goes for the aura sphere. So I'm assuming he doesn't seem to either want to stall or he just doesn't have recovery in general. So his Mew is living on its last leg. It's burned. It's not going to be doing too much for his team as now it can go into my Victini, which it seems if he has Aura Sphere, he may just have a Psychic Stab and that's about to be it. I'm not going to go for the U-Turn because I am a special variant. As he goes for the Psy Shock, that is not enough to break my sub, which is great. As I do have leftovers, I'm going to be regenerating some health and I'm just in a really safe position right now. So here I can easily go for the Fire Blast. I unfortunately do not have the blue flare as it did not come with this set, but either way, Fire Blast hits and it's enough to obviously take out this Mew. So now he needs to think, what poke am I going to bring in that's possibly bulky enough to take a hit and at least break his sub? As he brings in Meloetta, which is a good idea as it does have Relic Song, which will hopefully do enough, or maybe he's using Hyper Voice, we'll find out. As he goes for the Relic Song though, which should not break my sub as it's going to go through, which is almost unfortunate for him depending on his speed investment. But judging by the amount of damage I've done there, his Meloetta is either super bulky or Assault Vest. Nonetheless, he's going to go for another Relic Song, which is not enough to take out my Victini. As I live with 9 HP, I'm able to go for another Fire Blast, which is not enough to take him out though. As now, I can just go for the Psychic, thankfully, as it is at this range going to take him out. I couldn't before, as Fire Blast was definitely the one that was going to do the most damage. But yes, I'm still behind a sub at 29 HP, but unless he has any more sound moves coming, I'm in a really safe position. As here, I can just press Fire Blast, hopefully be a 2 a KO, but no. It seems all these pokes are just really specially bulky. I know Espeon is natural, and I know Meloetta is natural, but you know, Victini is a powerful mod. Either way, he is going to be able to break my sub with a shadow ball. I'm just gonna go for one last fire blast. Hopefully take out this SPL, but that is not gonna be the case as the shadow ball is now going to take out my Victini. And at this point, his SPL is definitely extremely revengeable. I've got the Darmanitan. It's a scarf Darmanitan. It's ready to wreck. I'm just pressing Flare Blitz. No need to mess around as this Espeon is uh, going to take a clean 5% remaining from its health and definitely faint here. As now he brings in the Medchan, I'm kind of worried about that, but at the same time, Time, I do have the talon flame in the wings. Oh, that was a great pun I just came up with. Guys, I'm sorry, please don't unsubscribe for that. Anyway, I'm going to press flare blitz here. Apparently, he didn't go for the fake out of the bullet punch. I 
don't understand that play unless he didn't carry either, in which case I want to change your set, man. But yeah, now he can bring in his Jirachi, and unless he's scarfed, I'm going to outspeed and destroyish this thing, as that is the case, and so his Jirachi's going to go down, and I guess he doesn't have anything for Darmanitan. Look at all that recoil, but Darmanitan having that awesome base 100 HP stat allows it to live so nicely. So Victini and Darmanitan, look at them doing so much work, but that was a really fun game. Sample sounds, unfortunately, was kind of lopsided, but I did have kind of the poke advantage. But yeah, guys, I certainly do hope you enjoyed. If you'd like to record with me or things, there's have been some very generous people that have wanted to record with me just so I have some more content to upload. If you're into that, message me on Twitter, message me on Skype. I don't care. You guys are awesome. Thanks for watching, guys. Like, comment, sub, and until later, peace.